Turkey to give me gadgets and gizmos. Um, anybody recognize what this is? This is your typical arcade cabinet. Um, I actually built this one. Uh, I got the parts all pre-done from this company, which I will talk about in another post uh, for those who are interested in arcade machines. But uh, a company called Ion actually wanted us to relive those nostalgic days of playing video games through an arcade machine. Uh, you know, I don't know if you guys remember where you had to feed quarters into these things and you would play all day. You spend your entire lunch, your all your lunch money, your your weekly allowance on arcade machines, playing Street Fighter, Mortal Kombat, um, Centipede, Asteroids, uh, Donkey Kong, uh, Pac-Man, Miss Pac-Man, you name it. Anyway, so I had actually made a tabletop version um, of an arcade machine that could work with the um, iPad. Um, and then you can download the emulators and play your games on that or you can um, actually download something called the Atari Classics It's a collection of um, the Atari 2600 popular games uh, that you can play on your iPad Anyway, so I had made this table tabletop version um, Right, which is uh, I'm actually gonna do a, uh, a Review on this where you put your iPad inside here and you know look, if you look at the buttons the buttons are like arcade style buttons from back in the day and you have your custom you know your, your customary joystick with a red knob but I didn't stop there they decided to go a step further for those who are really into collecting these things they made a junior version of that called the iCade Junior okay so what I'm going to do today is do a review of the iCade Junior which is the mini mini version of its big brother the iCade today I want to Go back in time and, and remember the nostalgic times of Pac-Man, Centipede, and Millipede. Um, you know, any any of you youngsters out there today would not know about the retro gaming days, you know, of the 80s. Um, anyway, so let, I, I kind of digress here. Let me really get to the point. I want to demo this cool gadget. Um, it's from a company called Ion, and it's called the iCade Junior. You heard me, the iCade Junior. This little baby uh, is a small miniature replica version of a typical arcade cabinet. Um, and then for you oldsters out there, you know, 30 plus and, and older, um, you know, arcade cabinets were the thing of the 80s and I believe in the 70s as well, where people would spend tons and tons and tons of quarters. They would just feed quarters into these machines and play millipede and, you know, blocky graphic type video games all day or at their lunch hours. Um, you know, so, you know, there used to be cigarette smoke filled arcade machines all over North America. People chugging coins away in these things, just playing, playing and playing. So today I want to visit, revisit that experience in a miniaturized version, thanks to Ion. And this is called IK Junior. And, uh, what I want to do is this, uh, I tell, I, I think if you've seen a couple of my other videos, I always talk about the packaging. I love packaging. And this is some pretty you know good looking packaging very colorful has a really good um, picture of the uh, IK Junior on the front and I love the colors so let's open this bad boy and see what's inside I love opening packages to me it's Christmas Day every day okay so we have our customary warranty and product information and then there's nothing else inside that box so what I like is that it's you know packaged well. I can drop it, hit it. I would try to drive over it with my car because I think, don't think this packaging is that strong, but very good packaging anyway. So let's crack this bad boy open. Let's see what we have. Put that over there. Get that out of the way. Oh, just moved it. Oh, looky here. The iCade Junior. Has a little top here. Some controls. Some buttons. Hey, there's some buttons on the back as well. Four to be exact. Nice logo. Now, if you guys don't believe that this is small, here's a bottle of water. And you can see that the bottle of water is at least two to three inches taller than the IK Junior. Now, 
Ion, of course, did make a big brother to this called the iCade, and I'm going to do a review on that as well in another video. And that the iCade actually stands about, I don't know, about a foot tall, maybe a little higher than that. Actually, yeah, more than a foot, maybe two feet. But it's a nice tabletop design. But this is really cool for you gadget lovers out there who want to, you know, hey, bring this to work and put it on your desk, right? Um, so let's just look at the 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 features of this IK Junior. Um, so the this hinge cover is obviously designed so that you can put your um, iPhone. And by the way, yeah, this is only compatible with the iPhone. And to be more exact, uh, if you want to to put a phone an iPhone in here where you can cover it down, anything like the with the i5, the iPhone 5 or the 5s and above. What's going to happen is it's going to be so tall that it's going to actually stick over the top. Um, so this is actually designed for the iPhone 4S and the iPhone 4. Um, and just to prove what I'm talking about, I have an iPhone 4S right here. See, when I put the iPhone 4S in, that's how it goes. You can close the cover. So the 5S or the 5 would be a bit above. Um, and so you can still use the 5 or 5S. The only thing is you just have to be you have to, you have to keep the cover open, right? So remember that the IK Junior uh, A it's designed for the iPhone only, and uh, it uh, you 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 have to use the 4S or the 4 for the cover to close down. Um, so other features, so you have four RK buttons right here. Now, they're not as strong and durable like the original arcade buttons of, on the big cabinets of the 80s, but, you know, for, for what it's supposed to do, it's supposed to be a nice novelty item. You can play games with this very easily. Um, you have a four-way D-pad, and it feels pretty good. What I like about this as well, you can actually unscrew this. I mean, this is, you know, what's an arcade, what's an arcade machine without the, the knob, huh? But you can actually just use the D-pad. Like you know, you did do on a typical like uh, Nintendo 3DS or whatever. But I am from the old school gaming. I love my red lollipop joystick. So give me it, damn it. So there you go, red lollipop joystick. Uh, what else? Um, so that's the D-pad with the removable um, lollipop uh, joystick. Uh, you have your four buttons here, arcade buttons. We talked about the cover. What I love about this as well. Um, is uh, it just looks like a mini arcade machine to be honest it's it's and you put this on your desk at work and you will get attention especially from any fellow fellow geeks out there who love gaming um, I love the, the, the decal on the sides um, what's interesting though is that the decal that came with this model is different from what's on the box but still looks pretty cool um, and uh, at the back we have four more additional buttons so uh, if you're familiar with a typical gamepad, these could actually be, you know, your shoulder buttons. Um, if you're, you know, depending on the game you're playing, these could be your shoulder buttons. But that's another thing, right? I mean, so the IK Junior, there is actually um, uh, an arcade classics app that you can download from the um, um, iTunes store um, that's designed to work with this. And the uh, arcade classics comes with about 100 um, Atari 2600 games. Um, it has a nice skin on the front, so you can actually see the arcade machines when you run the program, and you can scroll through which game you want to play. So if you want to play and, and you know live, relive the good old days of Centipede, that was one of my favorite games. Uh, go ahead, um, and for you, you know, so so, so uh, what I'm going to do, I'm, I'm going to do another video where I'm actually going to you know show you the app uh, installed, show you how to pair the you know, the app on this phone on the iPhone 4s connected up to this via Bluetooth. And yes, by the way, that's how this speaks to this via Bluetooth, right? Um, and then you can play the games. And it's it's really cool to see the games playing on this on such a small scale. I really love it. Um, so another thing I want to show you here at the bottom uh, is where you actually um, put the batteries in. So this uses two AA batteries. Uh, and for you um, guys who love to talk slang, you call them pen light batteries, but two AA batteries. Um, it usually comes with them, actually, and these were the, I believe these batteries came with this unit. Um, so I would actually recommend, you know, when you do get the batteries, throw them out, 
because they're usually you know some cheap El, El Cheapo type batteries that will leak anyway just put a couple of brand new alkalines in there and they're good to go and this is the slot where you can actually put your your cable to charge your phone while playing now one observation with this particular model um, the iPhone 4s has the wide connector but for some reason the connector on the bottom of this is small enough just small enough that the iPhone 5 or 5s connector can connect through not the fat connector that connects into this so if you uh, want to I wouldn't recommend it you could try to make the hole bigger I would just you know what I won't do that just charge this up and you can get a couple of hours of gameplay anywhere without, without connecting it to um, an AC adapter because um, it looks really cool I don't think it will be very cool having this on your desk and you have a wire coming up the back it looks really cool like this I love it so this my friends is the iCade Junior you know and if you guys are creative why not buy 10 of these and put them in your you know make a miniature arcade room right it's really really cool um, of course if you want to get your grubby paws on one of these little things just check out the link below I have an Amazon uh, link there uh, where you can get one of these at a discounted price as well and check out my blog page at www.redtechbot.com should be there in the intro and at the end and I also have a, a blog uh, you know, doing doing my showing you my review and this in a bit more detail because I love to write and I love to type. So that being said, one last thing: um, when we do turn it on, there's also a little red uh, button here that lights up LED to show that it's powered up and whatnot. Um, so there you have it, the iCade Junior. One other thing I want to say about this as well is, as far as compatibility is concerned, uh, this is also uh, designed to work with the iPod Touch. So if you, have, if you have an iPod Touch that is roughly the same size as the iPhone 4 4S, um, you can definitely use it in here as well. So iPod uh, Touch and the iPhone 4S. Uh, and uh, I believe, yeah, if the 4S can fit the iPhone 3, 3S. So anything below an iPhone 4S, including the 4S, or the iPod Touch these uh, models that are no bigger than the 4S can fit in here nicely and work. And you know what, if you want to use the 5 or 5S, um, uh, you can put that in here as well. Just remember that the flap would have to be kept open. Okay, so that's the um, Ion iCade Junior.